Tonight, the night you night, it's about getting into the neighborhoods. Um, it's the neighborhood watch that used to be called. Um, it's going to the different neighborhoods. It's getting the neighborhoods together. Uh, it's great for first responders, police, fire, uh, elected officials to get into the neighborhoods and talk to people. Um, it's communication and it's neighbors getting out and talking to neighbors. And the message tonight is for them to look out for one another throughout the year. Well, I think the biggest component is it gets people out in their neighborhoods and they get to understand who their neighbors are. And there's always new neighbors coming through. And it's a good way to understand who are your neighbors. So it's important to remember the primary theme of the Night to Unite is looking out for each other. I think it's fantastic that all of the neighbors get together and really get to know one another and develop an appreciation for looking out for each other within the community. And uh, the more times we get to get out and meet our neighbors and be active in the community, uh, the safer and more enjoyable location um, and community we have. I think tonight is a great night for the neighbors to come together and socialize and get to know each other and know that we're all here to help each other if there's times of stress or to watch out for each other. And it's just nice to know who lives in your neighborhood and that we're all here to help each other. They're, they're the eyes and ears of the neighborhood. Uh, a police car can drive by only so often with two eyes you know, behind a windshield. Uh, these people live in these neighborhoods and they can look out for one another every day for many hours a day. So um, they're our eyes and ears and, and we need to have them looking out for one another and then talking to us or calling us when they see something that's out of the ordinary. If one's watching out for the other, uh, it, it just makes it, uh, it makes it so much easier for us because we can, we can rely on the neighbors. I think she's still preparing toppings. We don't have enough. <laughs> this is a wonderful opportunity for the residents of Wyzetta to get together, the neighbors get together, and it's a, a really a show of force and uh, appreciation for our public safety people. And it's, it's, it's fire, it's the police, it's also public works, it's uh, the city hall, it's all the people that work so hard behind the scenes to keep this such a wonderful uh, town to live in. We have the best professionals we could possibly have. And they get up every day and they're willing to put a badge on and show up for work and put their lives on the line for each and every one of us every minute of their shift. And please take time to let them know that whenever you see them, not just tonight, but uh, any opportunity you have. So thank you very much for supporting the coalition, but more importantly, thank you for supporting our departments of public safety. We get a lot of support from this community, whether it's uh, internally to the city council, uh, city staff that we work with, but uh, the businesses and the residents um, support us. And it makes our job so much easier, and it makes the community so much stronger. So. We wanted to just simply say thank you this year, so thank you. Uh, these are Scott air packs, uh, but these are what a fireman wears on his back all the time. It breathes air, it's just straight air, compressed air. A fireman breathing at uh, an accelerated rate can last about 20 minutes. So that's essentially the truck, it'll hold four people, an officer, a driver, and then two firefighters. This is what it's about, this is what the night to night's about is getting the neighbors together, seeing everybody. Looks like everybody knows everybody pretty well. That's a, that's a great start. And I'm sure uh, the chief will talk a little bit about, you know, making sure this is the why we're here is to keep your eyes open, your ears open. Uh, 911 is, is different than it used to be. It used to be just for emergencies and now it's, it's if you need a police or fire response, call 911. If you, if you want an officer to respond to your home, business, whatever, Call 911, that expedites things, gets things in the computer. Um, 911 is different than it used to be. We encourage people to use it. You're welcome. Thanks it was my pleasure. Cool. Thanks for being out tonight. Is just having the police officers and all the city officials coming and so that the kids too can see that they're really great people and that we're all here for each other. Thank you, Andrew, thank you very much. Have a great evening, you guys. Bye-bye. Honestly, the food was great. <laughs> uh, the neighbors were fantastic. Uh, we have just an amazing community and it's a community that really cares about each other. No, it's just, you know, it's a, it's just a lot of fun. It's uh, We've been doing this for I guess it's 32 years now, and it's just, uh, it gets better every year. So I think it reminds us to come together and reminds us that we're all supposed to be watching out for each other and 
you know, keeping track on each other's kids and each other's front doors and, and also being social and understanding that we're all in this together. It's, it's, it's getting to know all the people, seeing them again in a casual environment and, and having fun. It's, it's, it's a real feel-good feel night.